leave them on a high note. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name's Carolyn. If you're new here and I do a ton of try on hauls because I love shopping and fashion and clothes, today's video is super exciting because it's going to be a Windsor dress haul. So Windsor is a really popular brand that I feel like a lot of people know because they do have a in-store like that you can find at the mall and also a very, very popular online store that people go to buy like, prom or homecoming and like dresses for dances and everything like that but in general they have a lot of cute clothes so I actually went to the mall while I was home and I picked up a couple of dresses that I absolutely love most of them actually all of them are maxi dresses because I've been absolutely loving full-length maxi slash midi dresses I don't know why but the I still love mini dresses and skirts and everything like that but just maxi and midi length things are literally my jam recently I absolutely love them. I think they look so stunning on because it's just more, I don't know, I feel like it's more like grown up. Not that it's bad to wear like mini like length things, but when I wear like maxi or midi, I just feel so stunning. It's just a different feeling than wearing a mini skirt and they're way more comfortable. Like I don't have to worry about it riding up me, like pulling it down so my butt doesn't show. And a lot of them are just so figure flattering like these. So they're full length and tight. So they just literally show off every single curve of yours. So I'm absolutely in love. And I got my hands on four gorgeous like full length dresses. So that's what I'm gonna be showing to, for you guys today. I'm gonna be talking about them and holding them up and then I'm gonna have it on the side as usual of me trying on the dresses because I can't really show you the full length while on this camera unless I step like really far back but yeah that's how today's video is gonna go I hope you guys enjoy and let me know which dress was your favorite down below and again I'll have everything linked and listed in the down bar for you guys if you will not check it out and yeah thank you guys so much for watching so the first dress is this gorgeous gorgeous sage green color so as you guys may or may not know light blue is my favorite color and then sage green is my second favorite i just think it's so stunning it's absolutely gorgeous but this is it so and all of these i got in an extra small because again i am so like petite and tiny I usually need an extra small but this is it so it's very simple and it goes all the way down to the ground and it's pretty tight at the bottom as you can see from the full-length video that I have on the side it is so constrictive on the ankles like I can't walk in this I can like waddle because it doesn't have a slit or anything at the bottom so my stride is definitely restricted, which kind of is annoying that I can't walk normally in this, but it's still so freaking flattering. As you can see, it just shows up every single curve and it's just super, super gorgeous on. It is definitely, I would say, it's not terrible, like the quality, but it's definitely not amazing. Oh, Polly has better fabric but this isn't terrible the straps are probably the worst part because they are not adjustable for some reason all of Windsor most of Windsor's items dresses and tops they don't have adjustable spaghetti straps so they're just really flimsy and they don't adjust at all so for me a lot of times they will fall or they just won't hold up so that's kind of annoying but that's like the worst part is how flimsy the straps are and they're just not adjustable it does have a mesh layer behind the initial like layer that you see on the outside which is really nice because it adds extra protection for not only like coverage so you don't see anything but also just feels a little bit thicker and more sturdy than if it was just this top layer because it's so thin so it's nice that they put it like mesh insert layer underneath on the inside and with all these I wear my sticky boobs or like pasties on them so you don't have to see the bra straps but you still have your nips covered but yeah this is it and I just love the color I will maybe see if I can go to like a seamstress and get these adjusted into adjustable straps maybe but I don't know for the most part it doesn't move at all or fall down so I think it's pretty much fine but yeah this is the first dress it is just so Stunning. I love the color. That's like my favorite thing about this dress is the color. But let me know what you guys think after seeing it in the full length video. This second dress is very, very similar to the green dress that I just showed. 
So it is full length as well. So it goes all the way down to the ground. The fabric is a little bit softer and buttery than the green sage dress. I would say this is more, yeah, definitely like more buttery while the other one was more of a jersey thin feeling fabric. And this is also double lined. So it's just, it has like a thinner fabric on the inside. So it's not mesh like the green one. It's just a slightly more like cotton thin material so you have more coverage. I will say, I don't know if you would be able to see from the video, it is still kind of see-through. Like I can see my side tattoos when I wear it, but if I just wear nude underwear and pasties and if you didn't have tattoos, you should be fine. It has one seam down the middle and to the ground because it does have a slit. So at the very back of the dress, as you will be able to see in the full length video, it has a slit which I personally really, really love because this allows me, even though it's super figure flattering and tight and conforms to your body, I still can walk normally. Unlike the green one, it doesn't restrict my stride. So that's really, really nice. Again, it has flimsy spaghetti straps that are not adjustable. So that is kind of annoying, but it is still just super, super stunning and sexy. I feel like a little angel in this, like a sexy goddess angel because it is white and just absolutely just conforms to my curves and everything like that so I really really love this but yeah this is the white maxi dress that I got from Windsor this third dress kind of looks ugly like when you just are holding it up honestly this is the only dress that is not bodycon like all the others so it actually flows out at the bottom into like a loose skirt as you can see so it's definitely way more flowy it has kind of a ruched bust line where your boobies are held so it actually is really flattering this color is very similar to the first dress that i showed in that sage green color this is just a little bit more muted not as vibrant as a green as you can see this one is definitely more paler and muted while this is more vibrant and saturated of a color and these straps are definitely a little bit different you'll be able to see it in the full length video way better than what I am showing but it basically crisscrosses in the back so actually adjust these by tying these and tightening it in the back so this is great because you can tie this as tight as you want to literally squeeze in your waist and shape to your your curves as much as possible which is absolutely amazing because even though this is loose this still gives me such a nice hourglass figure. It is absolutely amazing. Like I got, I tried this on in store in a size medium. And even though the top of the skirt in the back was super baggy because it was a size medium, it looked so stunning from the front because again, I just tightened it to how tight I wanted it. And it was so gorgeous. But again, I just got this in an extra small so it fit the back and I can adjust it. So this is absolutely gorgeous. I love this and it's nice that it's a little bit more on the flowy end. So if I wanted something more like girly and not as like sexy, I don't have to wear the bodycon. But I still look super, super hourglass and still have a great shape to me in this one. But yeah, this is so adorable and just beautiful. I love this so much. Let me know what you guys think. This is the very last maxi dress, very similar to the first two again. So it is this kind of like beige light tan color. Again, bodycon all the way down to the ground. The only thing with this one is that the fabric is actually slightly ribbed. As you can see, it has that texture, vertical ribbed texture all the way to the bottom. Also, the straps are not like the other ones from the white one. It is just like the fabric is folded twice like onto each other and that makes the strap and then similar to the green one it's just folded and sewn onto each other like double layered and that makes the strap as well while with this one is like ponytail material if that makes sense it's kind of like that elastic rope band that a lot of companies and are changing to for their straps so this one is actually kind of nice because it's more elastic and tighter and just feels a little bit more secure than the just like the folded fabric of the other straps so the straps are a little bit nicer on this one and this one is again double lined as well. So a little bit of a like thin, soft cotton lining on the inside to just give it a little bit more durability and thickness to it. 
And then this one also has a slit, same as the white one, but instead it's on the side instead of the back. So I love this. This slit goes eh, a little bit higher than the white one. So it doesn't go all the way up, but it is pretty high, which I like. So it definitely gives my legs way more room to move and not have to be restricted. So that's really nice. I love a good side slit. So yeah, that is the last dress that I got from Windsor. And I absolutely love all of them. They're just so freaking stunning. I would definitely say if you have been iffy about trying maxi or mini dresses, just try one because they are just so gorgeous. They're just so beautiful on. You just feel like way more secure but still stunning and beautiful. But yeah, that is it for the Windsor haul. Let me know which dress was your favorite. And I again will have everything linked down below for you guys if you want to try any of the dresses that I tried on. I'll definitely try them out. They are so cute. The only thing is the straps. They have really shitty straps, but other than that, for the most part, for the price, Windsor is a really, really good place to shop for just any type of dress, basic dresses, everyday dresses, to more formal dresses. They just have such a wide variety of clothes. Let me know if you guys have ever tried out any of their stuff before and what you guys think of Windsor. And yeah, that's it for this video. And thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.